We're going to begin with the shocking new details in a deadly triple stabbing in the Bronx. New York police say the teenage son of one of the victims is now being questioned as a possible suspect. Eyewitness News reporter Kimberly Richardson spoke exclusively to the sister of one of the victims. She joins us live from the Mott Haven section of the Bronx. Kimberly. Well, Sade, sources tell Eyewitness News Jonathan Rivera's son tonight is in the hospital after checking himself in with cuts on his hands. Sources say the teenager appears to be having a mental health crisis, telling doctors he heard voices. So many people simply shattered and crushed by what has happened. A sister who lost her best friend and is speaking only to Eyewitness News. Breaking moment, Miguel Rivera, for the first time, sees where his 38 year old son Jonathan, there on the left, was murdered. Also killed Jonathan's little boy. Kaden, my, my baby. Oh, my baby, man. Both were repeatedly stabbed here inside their building on East 136th Street in the Bronx. Also targeted in the deadly attack, Caden's mother, 33 year old Hanoi Peralta. Here she is just last month, November 3rd, as Caden celebrated his fifth birthday. In an exclusive interview by phone, Hanoi's sister wanted the world to know just how special Hanoi and Caden were. For her safety, we're not revealing her name. He loved his mother. She loved that boy. Where he was at, there she was. Where she was, he was. They both had life purpose, and it was taken from both of them. The 911 call came in Sunday morning around 645. There, that's Hanoi Saturday inside a deli in her building. God give lies. They don't take them. And that baby and that young lady and their family did not deserve that. Jonathan was found in the lobby, Hanoi and Caden, inside the couple's first floor apartment. Her sister tells me she and Hanoi just saw each other a few days ago. We spent the day just doing some little shopping for Christmas. And the next day was Thanksgiving. I don't expect that someone to want to harm the devil, anybody of all people. A kid at that. Remembering Caden as a ball of energy who would light up a room. The sweetest little thing. He loved his action figures, anything Marvel. He owned a toy shop. <laughs> he had it all. And back here live, a memorial. This balloon you're looking at there, that's special. That's for Caden. Mutant Ninja Turtles were his favorite, were actually the theme of his birthday party earlier this month. As for that possible suspect, Jonathan Rivera's teenage son, we are told he has not been charged and that he is receiving medical treatment.